Hello. You might wonder, why are you in a coat? Because I'm about to show you a video that makes me feel disgusting. Now, if you're a man, you have something called a wiener. Newsflash. And what are wieners good for? Peeing on the toilet seat. <laughs> As my mum would remind me. However, this disgusting degenerate, I can't quite fathom as to how he went into the store he went into a shop whipped out his you know i can't do it on here obviously no i can't do it here but he you know brought a package and he you know i can't even say the word ejaculate on a woman's leg in dollar tree the man is not identified but he's been identified don't worry we'll find out who he is and we'll do a bit more research but holy dicks men are just disgusting well some men i mean imagine like, why would you want to do this i don't understand like i'm pretty awkward you know what i mean I, I don't really like going outside and being in spaces with large people you know what i mean i'm in and out i don't want to fucking see you how do you how do you you know bit am i thinking too much into it am i trying to create a theory you know how do you like build it up and then you know perfectly you know he must have been going in the car like you know like you know, like, oh. Look, he fucking nutted on my fucking leg! You <laughs> Don't laugh, it's horrible. I mean, imagine getting, you know, as she described it so elegantly, nutted on my leg. <laughs> it's just the way she said, she's like, oh, you nutted on my leg! <laughs> I mean, this guy's running, look at him go. You I mean, go to hell, bitch! Oh my god, he runs off like a little fucking bomb bomb. Anyway. Oh my god! Oh, she's crying. As you can see, it's blurred because no one needs to see that. But how do you build it up, time it perfectly, whip it out, and then proceed to do the crime? You know, this is disgusting and absolutely wrong and horrible, and I hope the man gets all the punishments in the world. However, it's quite an impressive skill, you know? It's slightly impressive, but it's disgusting. You know what I mean? It's like if someone was able to, I don't know, no, I'm not going to say that. Let's carry on with the video. It's horrible. She does cry. It's not nice. I hate hearing people. Oh, she sounds so upset. Like, just imagine if you were in the store. Sorry? I think language barrier. He did what? Oh, no language barrier. Kind of impressive. No, it's fucking wrong. It's horrible. You know what I mean? I mean, the poor dude. I mean, look, the woman whips out a phone, runs after him, and he runs out quicker than, you know, Jimmy Savile runs after a school bus, and fucking hell. It's horrible, isn't it? Poor her. That is just not what you want to do. That's not what you want on your cornflakes. No way, Jose. Although, some people do. We have an update. The man says, what does that say? It's not going to lick itself. I mean, apologies, the, the quality is as good as when you're trying to illegally stream a football game, but what is that? You know what I mean? Talk about a red flag, like, I don't have a red flag, but fucking, hold on, I got a little Spider-Man. Hey. Fucking sad man. Let's, wa let's watch the update. This just in, the man police say sexually assaulted a woman at a South Philly Dollar Tree store has turned himself in. The attack turned gaining national in. attention, even rapper Meek Mill tweeting today that he would award $2,000 to the person who finds him. Police identified him as 35-year-old Gary Miles. Yeah, it's not going to lick itself. It's funny how celebrity yeah, Meek Mill's got involved and offered two grand. You know what I mean? You feel like you could throw in maybe a little bit more than 2K, but hey, ho, here you go. But he turned himself in, you know what I mean? I mean, what well, was... What's his excuse? Um, I'm so sorry. It was a mistake. What? I have a super severe problem. My balls just are uncontrollable. Being a guy, you know what it's like. And the police officer's like, yeah, dude, no worry. High fives, go, go do it again. Who fucking cares? <laughs> Seriously, that's what they're going to say, because they're degenerates. But he turned himself in, I mean... I hope he has some good lawyers, because that one's going to be a bit awkward. He probably went, oh, fuck. I thought, you know, what was going through his head? I thought I'd get away with that if it weren't for these meddling kids and that dumb dog. Like, no. He's going to not go to the kids. Oh, fuck. But look, he's not got his hand in his pants. He must have Surrender happening after instant. disturbing video circulated on social media, appearing to show the end of the assault. It happened at the store located at Snyder Plaza on East Snyder Street on June 23rd. 
Police say a mugshot will be released once charges are officially filed. This just in, the man... After the assault, is a generous way of putting it in it. <laughs> How can you put this on at 10... Oh, it's 10 p.m. I thought it said a.m. You know what I mean? Welcome to your 12 o'clock news. A man has ejaculated on a girl. What the fuck? I'm trying to eat me lunch, mate. This is a horrible story and one I do not wish to ever hear about again. I'm sorry to the lady who, um, you know, got sexually assaulted. There's no uh, other way of putting it. But that was foul. You know what I mean? I'm wrapping myself up. I'm never leaving the house again. I don't trust humans ever, dude. If that was me... You know, I wouldn't even have stopped running after him, bro. He'd be dead. I uh, like, I, I honestly think I would like, I don't know what I'd do. If I'm a car, cable tie his nutsack, tie it to the back of my whip, and just first gear it the whole time and just drag that fucker. Yeah, bitch. And then I'd get justice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Anyway, have you ever been nutted on? Probably not, hopefully not, if you have. Was it an experience of a lifetime? Probably not. Anyway, good night.